My name is Jenny, and I've been married for 18 years with Jose. We have two boys. My oldest is 15, and Jeremiah is 11. My son Jeremiah is 11 years old, and his primary diagnosis is Down syndrome. Um, a year ago last summer, he was diagnosed with autism. Due to a stroke in utero, he has cerebral palsy, a uh, left side of the body has limited um, function, and he also suffers from epilepsy. He had infantile spasms when he was one year old. He's a very happy boy, loves, loves soccer. Um, he does not walk, so he uses a wheelchair to get around. He's nonverbal. So he is learning to sign and use um, a picture exchange communication. So you can show him flashcards and he is able to communicate with you that way. He has inspired all our family. He is the first in our family to have a disability. Um, the unknown was scary from the beginning, but he definitely has changed our life for good. He's taught us to live one day at a time and enjoy the smaller things that we didn't before. On Instagram, I saw an ad for the Pop and Go playpen, and I decided to purchase it for Jeremiah. I love that it's really easy to set up. So we bring it to our backyard and we put the plastic balls in there to create a little ball pit for him, and we know he's safe and secure. I use it for therapy with him, so I'm able to fit inside, so I'll go inside with him and I will bring some of his toys that require more hand over hand um, instruction. Simple directions like get in, come out, um, he's able to listen. And actually one of his favorite is he sits in the playpen and he likes to throw the ball to me. I want the world to know that although Jeremiah has multiple disabilities, that he is still an individual and that he needs to be treated like an individual. This is my norm. It's not anybody else's norm, but I want them to know that my son can do anything that anybody else does. It's just going to look different and that's okay. I really enjoy companies like the Pop and Go doing this. Um, inclusivity to show people that yes it was maybe created for children um, that didn't have disabilities but it could still be used you know with children with disabilities if you're a parent and your child has questions please come up to us say hi we always want to share our stories and information about our child this is the way we change the world and create a more inclusive environment